This is my Quasi Five Fish V6 with the uh, claw attachment. This is an aluminum claw uh, that works via remote on the dial of this remote uh, to open and close on a worm gear. Now I'm going to go and attempt to find my drone today. I have not uh, seen it since last June, which is many months ago, uh, being October now. I have been back to that pond time and time again to try to recover the drone. But the biology in the water is so thick uh, now that the, we've had a full summer of sun I can't see anything in there if we do see anything cool today and uh, here we might as well just kind of show you how the claw works there is a dial on the side so I open and close it and there we go you can see Hopefully it's going to be strong enough if we find the drone and am I going to be able to locate it in this massive expanse of a pond now? Uh, it's basically looking for a needle in a massive algae haystack. Good luck on your voyage to the deep. I hope we can get that drone today. Attempt number oh, at least 15. So into the deep we go. You can notice that the water is just absolutely full of life and biology. You can barely see, take note, in the lower uh, left-hand corner you'll see the position of my vehicle and I can just barely see. If I turn on any light, it's like driving into a snowstorm like I was saying. Keep looking. 21 feet, still looking. That's okay. Persistence, like anything in life, right? Patience, persistence. And really, it was just an obsession for me to find this and to continue looking for it until I did. And then lo and behold, my friends, check it out. Look right there. I have never grabbed anything with this claw before of any consequence. I've got one shot at this because I don't want to, you know, frig up and, and, and make a whole bunch of turbidity with these six thrusters. You'll see I'm already starting to kick stuff up one chance here to really just kind of grab it. It's plastic. Is it brittle after six years? Uh, can I grab it? Ah, uh, this hook is on a, this claw is on a worm drive. I'm losing it. I'm trying to lift it right now. Yes, I'm just totally going to get this. I'm totally going to get this. Yes, it has been so long. I have been hunting for this for so long. I don't want to lose this. I just have to take my time and slowly pull on the tether. Oh my god, after six years of hunting guys, after a finding attempt and then not being able to get it back and then getting a claw, I cannot believe I'm about to pluck the DJI Vision 2 from the pond. My friends, you deserve to be here with me, let's go get it. I'm so glad. I didn't have enough power with the drone for, or with the, with the underwater ROV for some reason. It was either very heavy or it was stuck on the bottom. I had to basically gently pull it back into shore. But look at this. Oh, and I got the battery. Yes. It is recovered, my friends. I did it. I did it. I can't believe I got it. That's unbelievable. It all comes to a head and we finally get the drone out of the pond, guys. It's been an incredible journey, guys. I'm gonna find new places to have fun with my five fish, go underwater hunting. We're going into the winter season. That means it's gonna be nice, clear water in the springtime. We will see you guys in the next episode of RC Adventures.